hi guys welcome back so today i will tell you a uh, one workaround okay one workaround for an it's not a issue okay but i have seen uh, people facing issues in generating report okay um, report in the sense like whenever they uh, execute um, their test case in the execution list and they want to generate the report okay so while generating the report they will get one uh, pop-up like no printer available which i will show you okay suppose this is my execution list okay and this print report is there like who don't know i let me tell you like uh, in tosca we have some inbuilt reports are there okay by default some reports are um, given by tosca okay tricentis which you can generate so how you can generate just right click on the um, your execution list and you will see one print a report option and this is the uh, default reports which we have inbuilt reports available you can select any reports let me select in one of the report just see as soon as i am trying to print it is giving me error no printer available okay for this error i was talking about so how we can um resolve this issue okay how we can get rid of this pop-up i will tell you today okay so whenever you can get this pop-up just click on ok button okay now go to your run window and type services dot msc okay and hit the enter button you will see one new window will pops up which is called services window okay in this services just uh, look for uh, one service name called print spooler okay once you come down um, you will see here okay right here print spooler okay just right click on that okay and in this print spooler window in the general tab okay no need to go to other tabs in general tab here whatever options are selected by default okay suppose if it is not automatic you have to select automatic okay and then click on apply and then click on start okay this print is puller will help us to print the report okay now i have started the service just click on okay you will see here stop the service that means service is already running it is asking us to stop but we we should not stop this service okay we have just started it just close this window now let's try to print the report you will see that pop-up is gone and we are in print option uh, window okay now you can you can print your report in this many formats okay let's first we'll see you can select as per your requirement okay normally uh, i for our um project we will use uh, pdf okay and and you can before printing there is one option like before going for final print you can preview also if you select preview click on start it will show you the execution report okay whatever you have your test case is doing all the steps it will show okay this is one basic report okay suppose if you are fine with that report okay if you are fine with this basic report you can export from here to pdf okay suppose you are not fine with it you want to check another report just go here again you print report go to detail logs or any other reports which is available again i will preview it okay so if you go for detail logs it will ask for additional details like do you want only failed test cases to be shown no we want both reports okay and then we'll ask whether you want to screenshot to to be include, included okay i'll say yes okay which login for column you want you would like to show okay like used value i want so with that report i have got only two pages okay so this default report with available with tosca you might get more pages because my test case we don't have more more steps okay 
based on your test case length it will give the report the report might go for 100 pages also okay and i think i have selected failed only that's why it is giving test execution report failed only okay so this is just for example i have shown like how you can generate the report okay and in sometimes what will happen once you right click you will not see this print option only okay for that scenario in, in suppose if you are not able to see print option so there is some issue with your this reporting okay reporting folder if you go to your parent folder okay parent folder in the reporting if you expand this reporting we have this reporting folder okay and if this is not synchronized okay okay if this is not synchronized then you won't be able to see this print option so whenever you will see like you are unable to see a print option print report option you can go to the parent folder in a reporting structure and you can synchronize whatever reports we have inside okay once you synchronize you will be able to see the print report option okay okay guys that's all for uh, this issue print issue okay thank you bye bye